So before we start the show, I thought I'd come in and talk to you lovely people because you see, when we started recording, the co-host and I were guzzling down some Celebration L, which means we became very loopy and very wild very quickly. So in order to give you some guidance, I thought I'd provide you with a little bit of a rundown of the show, which includes discussions about the hippie store down the street, the popularity of podcast, the spill party in Georgia and the upcoming spill party in Austin, the spill film festival, my hobo living roommate, our favorite movie so far this year, film snobbery, black Hitler, weird out with breast, a very talented broom, more music recommendations, the return of Mac rib and email. And yes, at four hours, the show is split in two. Deal with it. Enjoy. My mang mang. Oh, shit. What's my, going on here? My What's mang going on? Behind the mang. Oh, no. What's going what is, on, man? What, what is up, my mang? Mang. <laughs> Put that G at the end. You know, like like uh, Scarface. Tony Montano. Tony Montano. Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, man. Used to put that. Used to put that C in front of that hey, and put that G <laughs> after that man. Hey, <laughs> man. Hey, man. What you doing, man? What you do- <laughs> Take it going, easy. Man? Take it easy. The saga continues, man. <laughs> How you doing? Fly pelican, fly. <laughs> no, I was waiting for that. Fly pelican. Fly pelican. <laughs> Look at this guy. He got a tongue like a lizard. <laughs> How you doing, man? Uh, I'm doing good. Doing good, man. Just, just hanging, just chilling, well, cold we, chilling with our with our gets... celebration station ale. Is that what it's called? Celebration Station? No. Oh, Celebration it's just called Ale. Just, Celebration Ale, yeah. Well, that's what we're doing. It's, it's appropriately uh, titled. Yeah, Sierra Nevada with the, uh, yeah, all the uh, Christmas uh, labeling that you, you can ever wish for, yes. The point setters <laughs> yes. on the label. Yeah. This is good stuff, man. It, it is. Uh, uh, yeah, point setters on, on beer. I don't know. It's, it's kind of a fruity choice, but. Uh, <laughs> It makes it, it makes you it gotta get nice, over those decorations nice and colorful. And things. Yeah. I guess. You get, yeah. Don't be afraid. You're a real man. I'm scared. You're a real yeah. manly robot. It ain't, you're not, it's because there's flowers on there. There's fucking flowers on my beer label. Yeah, exactly. I don't know if I like that. Hey, man, your beer is, is made from wheat. That's kind of a plant. In I'd a rather way. have my beer made out of pussy. No, what's that? Some, what'd you say? You with, have, with a big titty girl on the label, have, but have breasts and vaginas all yes, over the label. Except, yeah, I don't. I don't think that would be too cool to sell. In this grocery store with, with the kids walking around. No, probably not. No, but with their al- alcoholic fathers but, getting <laughs> getting beer for the, hey, for bar. the weekend. Yeah, dad been to get a six pack of this pussy beer. <laughs> yeah. Come on, boy, you little sister boy, drink that pussy. <laughs> Where's Big Bush beer? <laughs> That's my favorite. Put some hair on your face. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, sorry, people. We oh, started out just so so nasty. But hey, sweet, that, sweet juice. <laughs> gotta give you a flavor of what you're in for. Yeah. Yes, that's right. Man. The bullshit time. Bullshit oh, hour. It is the bullshit. Or bullshit a- five hours. It is or. the bullshitting hour. <laughs> the bullshitting hour has begun. Yes. Hey, man. Oh, uh, let me tell you something. What? Tell hey, me. Listen to me. Now, now, that's how you know that I drink a lot. Because whenever I enter that fucking store over there, that guy's waiting. That guy's uh-huh. in that store. There's a dude named Malcolm that, that's in this store called The Whip In. Now, Whip In. Has turned into a cool ass store. I mean, now yeah. when you walked in, did you see they put in like the bar? Yeah, and all they, those all those uh, taps. Yeah, over they have there? like a little dining area. Yeah, it's all decked out now. Oh uh, yeah, obviously they're making some money. Yeah, because all that stuff was like renovated this year, I think. And those motherfuckers went from selling Snickers, yeah. to being like a full restaurant <laughs> slash <laughs> bar. And the weird thing is, like an Indian type bar now. I guess they they sell a lot of Indian food, don't they? They they do. They, okay. That's their specialty. They sell a lot of Indian food. Uh-huh. And they also sell sandwiches. But the but the funny thing the, is, the weird thing is, I don't see any Indians working there. They so. they are. They're running oh, really? the place. That's why they got. Oh, all the, really? That's why they got all the blacks, whites, and Mexicans working. Oh, for working them. the front. Okay. Now when we went in there, <laughs> what, people when, we just got out of there. Uh-huh. Working in that, what did we see? We uh-huh. saw a black man. A Mexican uh-huh. girl and a white uh-huh. dude. Yeah. When no Indians around. Exactly. They run in that place. <laughs> they don't discriminate there. No. At least. <laughs> no. I think they had the Chinese guy in yeah. the back uh, packing boxes. But mm-hmm. yeah, no, they, they don't they, they, they don't work there. They mm-hmm. but they have been there. Yeah. Cause I remember one time I went to go get I went over there to get a pizza. Uh huh. Because, you know, they sell... Wow, they sell pizza, too. Man, they... Well, no, they have frozen oh, pizza. Oh, frozen But they said... But see, they're the healthy store. You know, uh-huh. because they're like... In, this this part of town is the... As much as I talk about hipsters, mm-hmm. like, this is the yuppie hipster part of town right here, the bo- bohemian. Yeah, it And is. so that store has turned into that. Yeah. And, and it's so, funny because it didn't used to be, but yeah. It was just kind of a convenience store, but yeah. they always had that beer selection. Mm-hmm. So I went over there because they sell the... Since it's such a bohemian store, mm-hmm. you know, they sell, like, the healthy pizza. Bunch of hippie shit. Yeah, yeah a bunch of old hippie <laughs> shit. Yeah, it, it, uh, 
Yeah. Fucking uh, you know, the, the the pizza's wrapped in tie dye shirts and yeah. shit before you bring it home. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> no, it's a like, pineapple it, on everything. Yeah, 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 pineapple, and I think they yeah. had some of those po- yeah. poinsettias that you see on the on the label <laughs> on those flowers too. It's our seasonal pizza, <laughs> but so I go over there to get me uh, get myself a, uh, a healthy pizza, mm-hmm. and I went to take it up to the counter. And that motherfucker would not let me buy my pizza. They, mm-hmm. There was an Indian dude working there. I forgot yeah. his name. Mm-hmm. Nice guy, though. But he was like, you know that we uh, we make Indian food now. I was like, yeah, man. I just came up and get a pizza. <laughs> just made it fresh today. Uh, yeah, man. I, 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 maybe next time. I want a pizza. <laughs> I made it with these own two hands right here. <laughs> like, yeah. man, come on. I want, I want a fucking pizza. You mean those hands that you were scratching your ass with? Said, yeah, one of you were digging <laughs> your balls with. <laughs> Digging for gold. Exactly. <laughs> Balls that like Indian food. Underneath them hills. <laughs> <laughs> Digging his I nose made, and I, everything. I made it just for you, Cody. Damn, I remember being a kid. Wait, why do I sound like a black guy when I do I don't, that? I, when you do an Indian I made voice? it just for you, Cody. <laughs> I made it. I, now I can't even <laughs> do it. I sound like a fucking muppet. <laughs> I made it just for you, Cody. <laughs> I remember <laughs> my mom. I, I don't know. You know how kids, when they're little, they just pick their nose and... No, I, remember, I, I never, I n- never knew of anything. No, you don't have any no. hands. But no. I remember, I remember my mom had expression. Like I, I can remember being like five and six years mm-hmm. old. I was nasty, just like yeah. any other kids. You yeah. know, I had my hand all in my ass and mm. fingers up my nose all the time. In the ass and up the nose, up around the, nose. the corner. <laughs> yeah, in that order. <laughs> Look out, mouth. <laughs> Here it goes. <laughs> I remember I had my hand in my nose one time. My, 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 not my, oh, damn, I said my hand. I make it sound like I was fisting my nostril. That's but I a had very my, shocking image. Yeah. I know. I had my finger in my nose just going to town. And my mom had this expression. Mm-hmm. Boy, you just, just digging for gold, ain't you? Just digging for gold. <laughs> yeah, it's just, I'm trying to get you a nice yeah. Christmas present, oh, I'm, I'm digging for snot. Here's a, here's a little nugget just for you, mom. <laughs> yeah. No, nah, people. So we are having a party coming up this weekend. Party time already. Oh, party huh? time. Well, I think it's more of a get together because this isn't. Is this is one of those non-official things that some uh-huh. of the members have decided to get together. It's unofficial. So yeah, unofficial. So I don't know how many people are show up to something like this, but mm-hmm. it is a party being thrown in Georgia. Oh, by our, uh, our own Ozma. Ozma. Ozma of Oz, a member called mm-hmm. Ozma of Oz on the site. Okay. And she decided to like put uh, a little get together mm-hmm. together, <laughs> <laughs> and. She asked us if any of us would come in. I know Leon was talking about going at one time. And Leon talks about going to a lot of places. <laughs> and never and goes. never goes anywhere except for the comic book store. Except that that's where his <laughs> money goes. Yeah. That's why he can't go. <laughs> Motherfuckers will spend a whole uh, plane ticket to, that he could have spent going to Japan. <laughs> buying the goddamn funny books. No, Comic-Con is like him going to the Bahamas. That's, that's, exactly. That's like his paradise. He's the one. He shows up at Comic-Con with like an inner tube bone and shades like he's on the beach. And fucking, yeah. He's hey, all, wearing the Hawaiian shirt with the dollar bills. Like he's yeah. Already, like he's already prepared to go to the titty club. Got that club. fucking straw hat right after, Yeah, right after he gets his comic book goodness on, <laughs> he's going to go get his titty. Pity goodness on. <laughs> <laughs> Sit up there and read comic books with the stripper. The thing is... You can't beat that combo. L- Leon always manages to find the stripper that likes to talk about comics. Because he... You know, when they go to the VIP room, yeah. they ain't drinking champagne right. and he's motorboating mm-hmm. titties. You know, yeah. he's in there talking about Superman. Mm-hmm. Well, you know what? I don't, I don't think so much that they're, they're concentrating on comic books. I, I just think that they don't understand them because half the time... Uh, I notice him with a stripper. She never speaks a lick of English. <laughs> it's usually some Spanish chick. <laughs> so yeah, uh, just going C the right whole now, time. Yeah, baby, we got green yeah. Green Lanterns. We got yellow Green Lanterns. We got red Ranlin, red I red just, Green Lanterns. I just don't know how they're bringing back Mary Jane. I don't, don't and, and and they're not even her and Peter Parker aren't even married. I just don't understand how that is able to happen with this red con shit. I and know. She's like what? And, he, yeah. and he's always trying to talk cool too. Like he's yeah. like, you know like like guys sitting on top. But yeah, baby, you know I'm a record executive. No, yeah. he sits around and talks cool like, yeah, baby, see, the Hulk went to another planet, and now he's ruling a bunch of motherfuckers that follow him, and the girls, like, yeah, she's yeah. that, like, like, oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, see? yeah, <laughs> Superman, yeah, no, Hulk, baby, oh, yeah, Batman, yeah, ¿Qué es esto? <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, underdog, oh, yeah, see, oh, yeah, <laughs> but... <laughs> Batman is muy bueno. <laughs> sí, papi, sí. Batman is muy bueno. <laughs> no, Batman tu buku. Batman tu buku. <laughs> oh, by the way, welcome to Let's Do This, everybody. Yes. Oh, now. Yes, well, welcome to Let's Do This, the, uh, yes, the, the second best podcast on Spill.com. Yes, the, according to... Uh, what are your sources? Uh, according, Where did you get that from? According to... 
Carlisle's numbers. <laughs> yes. <laughs> those, those imaginary I, numbers. Yes. I, I had no clue. And I, I, was, I was always scratching my head wondering, <laughs> scratching my head up against that old tree wondering, you know, where, where do we rank on this goddamn spill.com? <laughs> yeah, I know. Number two. It's like number shit. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. No, yeah. No. According to the numbers, yeah. according to his his in depth oh, yeah. research, <laughs> his his bizarro world research, Scoop yeah. Carlisle is on the case. Yeah. He's the Nielsen Nielsen yeah. ratings yeah. of spill. Like, damn, where the hell do you find these numbers? Now, keep in mind, people, we don't we we don't have this the bingo parlor war. We, yeah, we don't have this podcast war like some no. people had thought. We, we try not to. As hard as it is, we but try. when you when you just all of a sudden just bring out some numbers that don't yeah. exist, like, <laughs> and that is why, yeah, let's do this is not listened to as much. If you notice, people do not listen to the end of Let's mm-hmm. Do This. And if, if you notice, people don't I, listen to the end of Let's Do This as much. Like, man, I, every I heard, week there's comments about fucking the end of the show I, every week. I heard, and, and I was very, I, I hate to say it, I was very appalled by what I heard. <laughs> or even I looked at I looked at the computer and I said, what the fuck? I was like, motherfucker, <laughs> I make four hours. We, you know, we sit up here, yeah. I, I post up a four-hour show, uh-huh. and I split it up, and people are mad because they no. can't hear the end of it. People are fucking riding the streets. <laughs> Turning over cars. Yes, they're fucking. They're, they're throwing chicken at cars. <laughs> they're going fucking ape shit nuts. <laughs> you talk about the chimpocalypse. The chimpocalypse. Talk about the fucking. No, let's do this fucking apocalypse. <laughs> I know. Shit, I mean, I, I you know, just be cool about that. Don't 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 whip out numbers. Just convince yourself that something <laughs> yeah. is it it, it yeah. it's what you want it to yeah. be. Don't tell the audience that. Tell yeah. tell Carlisle that. No, I'm done. I'm letting everybody know. I wasn't gonna bring it up. No, no, hey, bag now, I wanted you know? to. Br- I wanted to bring it up. No, that's, I'm glad you because did. hey, I fucking love our show, and and I I have to admit, I, I wave our show, I I wave our flag up high, and when I hear something crazy like that. Oh boy, I, I was full of angry when I heard that. I was like, "What the fuck?" Yeah, if I were if I were in that full room, I, if I were in that room, I would have said, uh, "Hey, uh, did you ever listen to that show where uh, there was no show? Did you, did you see how many comments <laughs> popped up during that fucking yeah. that whole fiasco? Yeah, where there was no show yeah, that existed. There was, there was actually no show, <laughs> and that was like one of our most popular shows. Yes, the show that didn't exist. Uh, but hey, who who am I to argue with numbers? But let me let me say this. And I don't, because I don't want people to think that I'm sitting up here trying to say that Leog is no good. No, uh, hell no. Or uh, uh, a couple of Coleman's is no good. I'm mm-hmm. not saying that at all. I, I love that, Leog. All right. I think that all these shows have their distinct personalities. Yeah. They they have their own uh, dynamics to mm-hmm. them. But I I, I do kind of worry when complaints come in mm-hmm. that something is lacking and mm-hmm. and uh, so that's. But this well, you is, should worry. Yeah, no, no, because your I, name's on it. Yeah, I mean, exactly. Yeah. And I don't like when people are saying there's a there's a there's a lag here. There's a moment of uncomfortable yeah. silence. Mm-hmm. Why aren't you guys laughing? I mean, because right. look, when when I do this, I tell you the reason why I will always defend this is because mm-hmm. I know that to sit here for four hours mm-hmm. and not even think about the time at the end of it, right? Like you look at the clock and you're like, oh shit, we sat here for four hours. That means that we brought a lot into it, and I will. I'm not only defending myself here, but I know you come in here every mm-hmm. week, and you know we both got shit to do. Yeah. We sit down and we have a good time with this. We put everything we got into doing this. We do, and if and if it's no good, I, this is the thing I admire about you. Mm-hmm. You Who, come me? back, you me. No, I'm looking at the mirror behind. <laughs> no, okay. This is the thing I admire about you, Corey. I love you. Man. <laughs> no, this thing I admire hey, about you. That is you, funny because there is a mirror right behind. I, know, I was looking at that mirror. <laughs> it's like, but oh boy, <laughs> since you got in the way, yeah, all right. Since you got my line of sight, no, co-host you. Mm-hmm. I would say that one of the things I fucking admire about you, man, oh, is that boy. you will, whether it be this podcast or uh-huh. whether it be a review or something, mm-hmm. if, if it doesn't go well, mm-hmm. it's not about the fucking money. It's not mm-hmm. about time. It's like, mm-hmm. let's do it again. Yeah. You know, this that was yeah. no good. Mm-hmm. And we're not here to put our names yeah. on anything that sucks. That's why I always get mm-hmm. pissed off at people who come in and talk shit about you mm-hmm. or talk shit about this podcast because right. I'm like, look. It's not that I'm, I'm trying to compete with anybody, right. but I know what we put into this. Yeah. And I'd be, <laughs> goddamn, if you're going to come in here <laughs> yeah. and talk shit. I know. About this. How dare you? How dare, dare you? Fuckers, <laughs> I mean, no. there'll be no lack uh-huh. of talking yeah. here. Oh, no. I- there will be no. No lack of laughter here. We just going to be laughing the whole time through, unless we're talking about race. Exactly. We, we have to, yeah, we have to get real <laughs> serious for that. Serious. Put on, put on your serious face. And even then, we don't even get no, mad. No, no, no. Well, the funny thing, yeah, is like when we when we do get in discussions about things that you know, yeah, you can call. Obviously, they're serious. I guess. Um, and and hearing people go, oh no, they were serious. Oh shit, they must be pissed off. No, I mean we're we're 
We're buds, me and Corey. As, as hard as it may seem, you know, <laughs> you as, as, yeah, as, as hard as it is for, for the audience to to believe that sometimes. <laughs> no, uh, we're, we're we're pretty good buds, and uh, no, we're just shooting the shit like any good friend would. I mean, yeah. how many times have you seen your friends argue, and then all of a sudden, you know, what they end up beating the shit out of each other? No, it rarely happens. No, and if it does happen, that means. Obviously, those guys don't fucking like each other. Yeah, yeah, but, that's uh, wrong. Yeah, but you know the thing is that yeah, we we put a lot of hard work, and the thing is, I mean, speaking for you, I mean, you're in here doing the same thing as I am. We're recording this for four hours, and you know, and there's times when you know when we're done recording, especially a super long four hour show. Yeah, you know, you you look at the time, and then you're like, oh fuck, I'm sorry. You know, you apologize to me almost every time, and I'm just like, hey, dude, I didn't even fucking know. I for all I know, this could have been a, an hour show, and Hey, I had a good time. I'm not. I'm not bitching. Well, that's why I felt yeah, bad because yeah, I'm like, fuck, man. I should have been yeah. keeping better track of time. Right. I'm sorry. Yeah. Man. There's it, nothing it, I need to be doing at two in the morning anyway. <laughs> so it's not. It's not like I'm running late I'm for keeping anything. Your ass out of trouble. Yeah, you keep I'm my ass. You off the no, at no, two in the morning. You are keeping my ass out of the goddamn strip club. That's what you do. There you go. Saving <laughs> some, <laughs> some money. Saving some. Some. Yeah. Some Let well you, well earned dough. All right. fifty cents of it. Man, that that nice shiny <laughs> nickel we give you every week. Uh-huh. Why don't you spend it all? Oh boy, and I keep that thing shiny like you wouldn't believe. I bust out my turtle wax, spit shine, booty shine, like you wouldn't believe. But uh, no, no, I mean, we, I put a lot. Yeah, we both put a lot of work and a lot of effort into these shows. And I mean, like I said it before a billion times, like anything I do, I want it to be, I want it to be good, if not great. I want it, I want it to be at least fun for me to listen to, and I want, I want the audience to have it, fucking just a great time listening to it. And w- once that's done. I walk. I can walk away happy because usually, if I feel like either I didn't put in my all, I mean, I, I'll fucking I'll I'll be thinking about that show or that review for the the whole following day. Now, welcome to my world. And yeah, I just do just that. just when you're waiting for the comments to go, nah, eh, this is all right. Yeah, it's good. I can't, and yeah. I, I, I'm like, oh, well, I fucked up. Yeah, mm-hmm. no, I, I, yeah. I dread when I think something's going bad. I'll, oh, I'll yeah. walk the streets in torment, <laughs> no. like Edgar Allan Poe. No. You know, yeah. never more. And I, think, I will record yeah. a podcast yeah. never more. And I think that's why our shows go on for four hours because hey, we're doing we're, we're we are committed to the idea, and uh, yeah. I, I love that about the show. This is like I think with a show like this. Uh, Obviously, people have made have spoken loud and clear that they do not mind listening to a four hour show. I mean, we get complaints, yeah, fucking complaints. Which I wish you would have told that dude. We get complaints when we don't fucking put up a whole four oh, hours. Oh, that, we get yelled at. We get yeah. cursed at. We get yeah. people going, "What is this bullshit? What the fuck are you doing, Corey? <laughs> oh, I huh? know you lazy fucker." <laughs> oh, but oh no, it was said not on that show because hey, you know I'm not gonna bring all our dirty lines no, out in the no. open. But I, it was said. It's like, hey uh-huh. man, I, you know. I, if mm-hmm. I split up a four-hour show into two parts, yeah, people get pissed. Oh no, yeah, and it, and that was that was very apparent uh, the last show oh, we yeah. put up. And yeah. let me tell you people something about that whole thing about you getting pissed. Let me go ahead and get this out the way <laughs> while I'm I'm thinking about it. Mm-hmm. Four hours, uh-huh. don't mind recording it, mm-hmm. don't mind putting it up, mm-hmm. but four hours for one day when I'm like barely able to get up and get work to people that need it, you know, because mm-hmm. there's a lot of shit to do now. I I'm, yeah. I really might have to pull back on one podcast because uh-huh. I'm. And it ain't gonna be this one, so, <laughs> because uh, I'm, I'm just getting to the point where I'm I'm too busy. But it should be this one though, because we're number two. It's like, oh, like of course, it's yeah. like it's, uh, yeah. you should. That's it's, number two. I think. No, I think we're number five. Number, I think we're we're number yeah. five. We don't and we who don't even have five podcasts. Yes, that's right. I think. Well, who is it? The Gym Nazi and 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 the Splinter. I think they're, Silver Surfer. Yeah, Silver Surfer. Yeah. But man, let me tell I you, think you all those something. guys. Uh, four hours is a long time, and mm-hmm. I I go through and I listen to this podcast. Mm-hmm. Uh, again, mm-hmm. just to make sure if if it's, if anything is too long in the middle, or mm-hmm. if it, if I need to add something to it, or, or whatever, uh, I'd go ahead and listen to it. Mm-hmm. And that's a long time to listen to a podcast, you know, four hours in one day, and uh-huh. then have to go back and try to re- uh, post it. Right. So I split it up, not because I'm because people think that I'm splitting it up mm-hmm. because I want to use that as a way to tease people into. Uh, Wanting to yeah. check back again, therefore yeah. get in the site more hits. Tick- tickling their booty. With yeah, the feather. exactly. With the feather. <laughs> Dangling a carrot in front of their ass. How bad do you want this podcast, yeah. huh? Are you huh? hungry yeah. for it? Can you smell it? I'll suck your dick yeah. for another podcast, Corey. <laughs> Well, come on, man. <laughs> yeah. But no, I, I... I got these hamburgers. Yeah. <laughs> what you say to me? Be like in that movie where you see me... Cook, I'll suck exactly. your dick. What? Yeah. And you see me coming out from behind the corner, putting my shirt back in my pants. Uh-huh. <laughs> that was good. No, I split it up in two parts because mm-hmm. it's just easy for me to manage in mm-hmm. one day. Like, I know I can pay, I pay attention to two hours, an hour and a half, 
and the next day have my time allotted to do it for the second part. Uh, to do to listen to a four hour podcast, and try to post it all in one day. Sometimes kind of hard. Yeah, I'll do it if I can, but I'm not mm-hmm. doing this to tease anybody. Mm-hmm. I'm not doing this to try to uh, get as, as some sort of uh, gimmick or mm-hmm. some sort of method of getting more hits on the site. It's not that at all. It's mm-hmm. it's it's really is like man. I just don't. I was. I remember one day I was listening. And I was just like man. I I just I got to cut it off right here and just mm-hmm. put this part up. Because I'm was, sorry. Was, was we, <laughs> yeah, no, I was I'm sorry we, we sucked that day. Yeah, no, no. Yeah, it was when we first lost that show, and I was like, Carl, I was right. Yeah, fuck. <laughs> he was right. <laughs> no, nah, that day we lost the show, and we recorded, uh, yeah. recorded it uh, over. Uh-huh. That's when I was like, man, uh, you know, this is Thursday now. I got to yeah. go ahead and get something up quick. Right. And then that next week, the same thing happened mm-hmm. when we had it. Well, at least when we had another four hour show, yeah. I was like, man, I got to get something up. And that was a nightmare that day, because that, that, that was like one of our. One of our illegitimate illegitimate kids dying, and we were just like, "Oh fuck!" Uh, we won't even get into it. We <laughs> yeah. told you guys how hard bring up those was about painful that. memories. Yeah, but people, I, look, I'm not, I'm not being lazy. I'm not trying to trick anybody. So don't give me shit if I mm-hmm. put it in two parts. Uh-huh. I mean, because sometimes that's just the way it's going to be. Oh, you done it now. You're going to get tons of shit now. <laughs> they can give me shit. It ain't going to help reason. anything. Exactly. You know, if anything, hey, fuck yeah. with me. I'll put that shit up on Sunday. <laughs> I'll put I'll put that shit up in uh, one he, minute increments. He'll show you. Yeah, you listen to one. We, hey, you. I'll put that shit up in uh, four hundred uh, seconds. Four hundred second in- increments. Increments. Of, yeah, you hear inc- what, increments of two minutes. Yeah, you, the first show will be yeah. like, hey, everybody, yeah. click and switch it. <laughs> See switch, switch it up a bit. Put it on Leog's uh, fan side there. <laughs> make them make them look for that shit like so Easter eggs. <laughs> and that'll be the second show. <laughs> yeah. Everybody, I- yeah, make them find it all over the website, and they actually have to put it all together for it to make yeah. sense. There you go. Back one show. Now we're putting them to work. There you go. Yeah. Now you got. Yeah, you got to do the editing. Yeah. See how you like it, motherfuckers. <laughs> I'll, one show just be like, it. yes, yeah. that's, that's, that's all. Fuck your thought. Fuck. <laughs> fuck your thought. <laughs> Let's do. <laughs> eh, that'll be second show. Fuck. Eh, yeah. so. Nah, people. So yeah, we we appreciate all the compliments that we get, comments, mm. and we appreciate you. Right, and that is why we will come here and do our best to make this yes. the best show that we can. Exactly, and that is why I will stand up for our our fucking audience and our podcast. When I hear some craziness, and say, like I you. like I heard like on on the couple of cold ones, hearing that, I was like, I was like, man, that's that's like a slap in the face to me and and my audience. I mean, just no, don't yeah, we, yeah, we are not small fries here. I'm sorry, but you know, no, 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 and yeah. like I said, I'm not trying to. Turn one podcast against each other. No, I'm support, no, no. I'm supportive. Right I mean, no. this is all one hey, site. You can't have. No I'm supportive. Fight, I mean, I love listening to a couple of cold ones, you know. And obviously, I can, you know, I, I can. I'm very much with with the fans of that show. Where I obviously hear some, you know, problems with that show. Um, I'm not here. I'm not. I'm not one to try to help you with those problems because I don't give a shit about them. But uh, oh, you can. You know, <laughs> it's no, all part of one world. It, it, it you is. Care. But I'm just saying. No, I'm no, just. I, I'm just. I'm just saying though that. Uh, yeah, I mean, we want honestly, we want all the all the podcasts to be great on here. I mean, Leo yeah. does a great job for what it does, and I understand, you know, the fans have their shows that they love and they're loyal to, and I have no problem with that. I don't even have problems when people talk shit about me on a couple of co ones or Leo when it's like, eh, co host, he does his thing, whatever. I don't give a fuck about him. I don't think he's funny. That's fine. Nobody's hurting my feelings as long as I know that you know there's something on there that they enjoy. It's nice yeah. hearing that somebody enjoys something that your friends are doing. You know, I get a kick out of that. I really don't need, I don't need any kind of, I don't need any kind of ass kicking, const, uh, kissing constantly. Yeah. Um. You know, people people like what they like, and and I'm not going to get and that's pissed. That. And that's yeah. all you can do. So so hey, people. We'll but stop. hey, there you we'll, go. We'll, we'll stop, stop our little yeah, rambling, we'll stop kissing on asses, yes, sucking on dicks, and all that kind of stuff. But um, let's do this rules. Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah. No, that, well, as I was saying about this party, mm-hmm. yeah, this party is going to be this this weekend. Ozma of Oz, mm-hmm. one of our members, she she's the one putting this thing together. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's going to be in Atlanta, mm-hmm. and oh, boy, she made it sound like it's somewhere outside of Atlanta, but essentially Atlanta. Yeah, and that this weekend is going to be, it's the, okay. She has something planned for the 11th and the 12th. I'm actually going to go because. I've only passed through Atlanta. I've never. I've been to the airport. Pass so many gas. Times. Yeah, farted in the airport. Just walked out. <laughs> Excuse me. Pardon me. <laughs> no, not. I'm it's, not even catching a flight. Yeah, it's only Atlanta. That's right. <laughs> ticket, sir. <laughs> There's your ticket. You yeah. fucking asshole. No, so, uh, yeah, I've only passed through that airport in Atlanta. I'm actually going to try to go. So I found a dirt cheap ticket, man. That's yeah. that's why I went. I mean, I looked that's up. It's dirt cheap these days. 
to Atlanta, 150. Yeah. Holy shit! Yeah, that's to, to fly that round trip. You know how many tacos I could buy with that? <laughs> Damn, I, I that party better doing, be good, Corey. Oh, uh, Taco Bella Lagosi will tell you. <laughs> I could get a hundred and fifty <laughs> bean burritos. I was a in chimichanga. In chimichanga. And 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 add dessert, some cinnamon twist. <laughs> <laughs> and he turns that bat flies off. A little Taco Bell bag in his claws. Yeah, see some lightning. That's <laughs> my. If you just listen to the show, people, that's my. Uh, that's, that's my roommate. Uh, I love how ta- you constantly have to remind uh, everyone. In, people to, in case you don't know, I live with the. Yeah. I live with the Taco Bell vampire, Taco it, Bella Lagosi. Yeah. <laughs> I call him uh, Taco Bell Nosferatu. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the, oh my god! Yeah, no. I'll always love that picture uh, that uh, of Nosferatu uh, on that bag. No, uh, no. <laughs> well, it's the one that I think Ryan did, Ryan Cordman, uh, where he had the uh, Taco Bell bag in one hand, and in the other hand he had the Dawn of the Dead DVD. Oh yeah, because we were talking about oh. yeah. Oh, your, that's right, your, When your roommate left Dawn of the Dead on, he left Dawn yeah. of the Dead that menu screen. Uh, uh, yeah, on, on the DVD. <laughs> I mean, he kept doing that. Uh-huh. Dun, dun, dun. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I was like, this motherfucker having a, like a seizure in here? Yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh, geez. And I recognize that yeah. menu screen. I was like, this fucking has this. It's like, yeah. he fell asleep, mm-hmm. and the goddamn Dawn of the Dead menu screen on the DVD is in is in loop right now. I mean, this <laughs> yeah. motherfucker ain't getting no, He doesn't even hear that shit. Right. First time I heard I thought he was dead. Mm-hmm. And then I, I, I knocked on the door. Uh-huh. Like several times, mm-hmm. and I heard those fucking uh, ravioli cans kicking over and sitting. Uh-huh. <laughs> clang, 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 clang. That motherfucker eats raviolis out the can like a hobo. No me, shit. I'll tell you about this. Let me, go ahead and, <laughs> no. let me finish telling people about this party. The party is going to be yeah. on on the on the on the eleventh and the twelfth. I will be there on on Saturday. Go to Ozma of Oz's page if you want to know more details about the about the party. If you're local, like at the last minute, I know it's it's kind of hard. If you can find a ticket for one hundred and fifty dollars and you can afford it, and hey, you know, you show up, do whatever. But I think yeah. it's you know it's kind of yeah. short notice right now. But perfect hey, timing for the holidays. I know, yes. I know. <laughs> Beat man, don't, fuck your family. Don't buy them <laughs> shit. Come on over to Atlanta. No, I'm I'm just gonna go because uh, she's been cool, and I like I said, I've never mm-hmm. seen Atlanta. She and there's some other people who are gonna show up that I that I know who have come to some other parties. Okay. So I I don't think it's gonna be huge at all. I think mm-hmm. it's just gonna be a get together, and that's fine with me. Yeah. You know, it's nothing like those. Goddamn uh, things, uh, those uh, hoot nannies that, that Nick Hodges <laughs> puts together. Uh, Nothing like the party starter does. <laughs> those hooligans. In fact, I asked Oz, I said, who's going to show up? She's like, well, I think my boyfriend and uh, my mom, my, my dad. uncle, and uh, I have two cousins that are showing yeah. up. They're bringing their dog. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to have an early Christmas dinner for you, Corey. <laughs> no, that sounds like it's going to be cool. We made cornbread because we know that. <laughs> Black people love cornbread. Black folks love cornbread. <laughs> I made some beans and rice and chitlins. <laughs> nah, so I'm gonna be there on Saturday. I'm not gonna leave on Friday like I told. You. I'll be I'll be there mm-hmm. on Saturday and I'll be leaving on, on Monday, mm-hmm. early Monday morning. So I will get All to right. see like a little bit of the city before I leave. Yeah. Again, that's go to Ozma of Oz's page. I'm already there. You're already there. You're not even at a computer, but you're already there. You can see before your eyes. I'll see the rabbits, George. I'm gonna, but, look, at, I'm gonna look at her pictures. Yeah. And uh, she's she's having a get together on on Friday night the eleventh, Saturday night the twelfth. I will be there on the twelfth through the fourteenth, fourteenth mm-hmm. meaning Monday morning. That's okay. what I'm leaving. So so there you go. And hip hop hooray! The, oh. I hope everyone. I hope everyone has a great fucking time. <laughs> you know, yeah, I like the I little look on your face, like yeah, motherfucker. Have a good time. <laughs> yeah. Fuck your city. Yes. Fuck your party. <laughs> Fuck your party. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this party. I got something fucked up to tell you about that party, though. What uh, party? About her party. I'll tell you after we get started with the show. We, we something we, fucked up about her party that hasn't happened yet. That, that was about to happen to me. Oh, I tell you about it. After okay, we, okay. Right now, though, people, we done Hey, look, we gave you. We just went in there with a big old. Spoonful of bullshit, <laughs> yeah. scooped it out and just fed it to you. We bought a snow shovel and we shoveled that shit right up in your right face. There, got it all on your nose and everything. You just ears. choking it down in every orifice. Uh, yeah, I, I think you can even feel some of it sliding down your back, like real slow, like where it's like, Ugh, what is getting ready to get strapped into the bullshit yes. train? Yes, got to give you a warning. I, had, I didn't do this last week. I didn't mm-hmm. do it the week before. But Uh-oh. in the middle of that time, I think someone almost died. Do not attempt to do the bullshit that you hear here. No, no, at no, home. don't do it. Because you might get hurt. We are professional right. bullshitters. We know what we're doing. 
<laughs> All right, so strap yourself in. I think Shaken got hurt trying to do his his little podcast show. Like, <laughs> who? Shaken. Shaken. Is that yeah, how you say his he's name? Doing, yeah, Shaken. Yeah. It's C H A. He used to senior. It used to be senior, senior Shaken. Shaken. Yeah. I used to thought it was. I used to think it was senior or sh- Chicken or chi- Yeah. <laughs> it's one of the members on our site as a podcast. Yeah. I thought I didn't. You know, I, just, I think it's called the Madness Hour. That's, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. The, the Madness, Madness Hour. Hour. Yes. Those great guys, show. They great do a show. good show. No, they do a great show. I never yeah. heard it, but they do a good show. <laughs> well, I'll listen to it. I heard. I heard two episodes. They do all right. Great show. Okay. You should listen to it. Senior Chicken. I think they beat us in the ratings, too. Oh, that's yeah, why we're number five. Yeah, our numbers. Maybe yeah. we're number six. We're just going downhill. Look at dwindling. that. Dwindling. Well, Bullshit <laughs> rolls downhill. <laughs> so, um, you, wait, you wait until Flesh Eater gets a show, and then we're fucked. Oh, I got some right. tape about Flesh Eater, too. We'll get uh, into that. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> all right, people. You got you strapped in. We done told you about what about how shitty this show is. Uh-huh. Uh, we're like number 10 in the, yes. <laughs> in the imaginary ratings. Yeah. <laughs> tell you about how we feel. <laughs> tell you about the parties going on. Mm-hmm. Oh, I don't know what else we can do except get this show started, Let's man. fucking do this already. All right, people. I'm ready. I'm fucking ready. All right, you ready? I'm ready. We told all these people to get ready. Wait, 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 wait. God damn, man. Oh, wait, hold on. Goatee just walked in the room along with uh, Taco Bell and Nosferatu. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, think. I heard my name being spoken. Don't you dare. Don't you dare speak of my... Of my my eating habits with the, the chef Boyardee. <laughs> <laughs> that story is not to be shared. I told you. It's just between me and, and, the, and chef. the chef Boyardee. <laughs> <laughs> Mamma mia. <laughs> All of a sudden he's Italian. <laughs> well, he's Italian when he's Chef Boyardee, obviously. <laughs> Company. <laughs> All right, Goat. See, why'd you bring this? See, why'd you, t- Uh-oh. Man, why'd you do this, man? Well, you got to tell oh, them what we're talking shit. about. You know, All you right. just can't keep your fucking mouth shut. Your little goat mouth. <laughs> All right, Goatsy's here. Goatsy's ready. He got he done no title tells yeah. us. No he's got ready. ready. We're all ready. Well, hey, let's do this. Let's do this. How silly. <laughs> oh, okay. Let me, before I forget this, I don't know what just happened three here. things. Three things I got to remember mm-hmm. to tell you before we get on with the show. Yeah. Got to tell you something about Flesh Eater. Got to tell you something about uh, Taco Bell, Lagosi, and uh-huh. uh, there was something else. Um, but the, the, oh, the, 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 oh, the, 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 why this part is crazy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Crazy. The, the, crazy, the craziness uh, that Yeah, man, I don't happened. know if I said this before, but uh, man, my roommate, John, mm-hmm. in there, he's... Uh, you know he's here, right? I know. Okay. That's what, why you think right. I'm talking like this? Why you think I'm hiding in the bed right now? Use your quiet hey, voice. Ghost. Is he out there? I don't know if that'd be good for a podcast, but yeah. yeah. Hey, let me tell you about him. Yeah, we're talking like uh, some fucked up. Talking shit, like uh, Don Corleone. Yeah. Hey, let me tell you about my roommate. Uh, let me. A man is never truly a man unless he's eating a cold can of oh, Chef Boyardee ravioli. Boy, Man, that fool, would, he does. He eats like a hobo. He lives like a hobo. He okay. eats. Because he comes in, uh-huh. and he flops down that, on not a couch, mm-hmm. but a futon. Okay. And it happens. I, I've gone in there before because I think he's left his TV on when he's, when he's left the house or left a light on. Mm-hmm. And there's like these cans of, of ravioli, Chef Boyardee ravioli, just... <laughs> Just open, just yeah. sitting there. I mean, he, did, and, did, did, and, is the lid still like like, like the lid like, still like hanging on the side? Yeah. yeah, like those cartoon cans, you know. Right. Like they never really like take the yeah. lid completely off. I don't know why do they do that in cartoons. Like the lid is never really off. I know. It yeah. just that's just they, they didn't have the electric can openers back then. Uh, they they or they didn't have the pull off tabs. Oh uh, yeah, I mean, but yeah, even the then, can, like, can technology wasn't wasn't going. But they had that like that. Time. I mean, come on, it's ancient technology that <laughs> that that can opener that you just twist yeah. and like it goes around. <laughs> I mean, those few extra turns yeah. can get that fucking lid off. <laughs> yeah. You you got to leave it on there. But he does yeah, it for he, nostalgia. That's all. Oh yeah, he's got that shit in there, eating like uh like just hanging around with a little little spoon still mm-hmm. in it. And I'm like, a little plastic spoon. Yeah, little, little, yeah, <laughs> the little white, little plastic, white spoon, like a spork. And, and, you know what? You, you're laughing, but it is like these oh, little white spoons because it? they're left over oh my from God. when he eats out so much. Oh. So the fucking cans are in there. Is there like two uh-huh. or three cans just sitting on boxes and shit uh-huh. that he's never thrown away? Okay. And I've opened the door before when he's in there, uh-huh. and that motherfucker's laid out like like he got drunk <laughs> off of Chef Boy ID. 